they're a living exhibit at the National World War II Museum in New Orleans. Letting the audience relive the past. Oh, because I did. <laughs> Bringing back many, many memories. Many, many, yeah. To bring that back and to remind them of those good times is just, it's an incredible feeling. Known as the Victory Bells, the group travels the world and has performed at USO shows, capturing the sounds of the 1940s. And the looks. Spending nearly two hours to achieve the right hair and makeup every time they take the stage. It feels silly, you know, sometimes putting on the lashes and the makeup and you think, what am I really doing? And then you go out there and you see how these people connect and the memories you bring back. And it's just... It's so moving, it really is. Founder Victoria Reed says it was important to carry on the music and traditions of America's greatest generation. There were just so many beautiful love songs written back in World War II. People really knew what it meant to miss each other. And the songs, the melodies were so singable and the big bands, just everybody danced. On this night, World War II veteran Forrest Villarubia was transported back in time even as he celebrated his 88th birthday. It's amazing. They're beautiful girls. I want to kiss them back, too. <laughs> a touching way to keep the memories and the music of a dwindling generation alive. Stacy Plaisance, Associated Press.